Hey, recently I started to do a review on the Mountain House chicken and mashed potato dinner. This thing's been around for years. A lot of us are familiar with it. It's been a standby favorite for a lot of people. But as I started to do the video, something happened and I ran into a bit of a surprise. Let's watch the footage and find out what it was. And we're back. Today we're gonna review this Mountain House chicken and mashed potato dinner. It's one of their freeze-dried adventure uh, meals that comes in these pouches. These are real handy because you can boil water. You put the water right in this pouch with the food and seal it up. We've reviewed some of these before and I think most people have, have seen these or are aware of them at some uh, level. I typically look for freeze-dried foods that have a balance of protein rather than just the macaroni and cheese, rice, mashed potato kind of things that are so typical with these kinds of foods. So we're out here in this beautiful setting today. We're going to boil some water up on our rocket stove and cook this thing up and see how it tastes. Okay, we've opened up our envelope here. They're telling us to take out the potato pouch. Obviously, we removed the oxygen absorber. And then we're just left with a bunch of diced up chicken like this in the pouch. And they're telling us to put one and three quarter cups of water uh, into the pouch with the chicken. Let it sit for the specified amount of time and then we'll add the potato mix directly into that. On my pan here, and I've covered this in a prior video, but I've scribed two lines in it. One at the one cup and then the other at the two cup mark. And that makes it real easy for me out here in the field to simply eyeball and make sure it's you know kind of level and I'm going to fill that up just to about what looks like almost two cups. Okay our water has come to a boil now we're simply going to add this to the pouch. Right now we just have our pieces of chicken in there and nothing else. Okay, we're going to seal that up and we're going to let it sit five minutes according to the Mountain House instructions. Okay, our chicken has sat for the specified amount of time and there's quite a bit of water in there but the mashed potato mix will certainly uh, absorb a lot of that just by way of interest this dinner now appears to come with the chicken diced up now i know mountain house used to have a mashed potato and chicken uh, dinner pouch that had two complete chicken breasts in it and then you added the mashed potatoes into the pouch with the leftover water so this is interesting to me i'm not sure if this is how mountain house is doing it now or if there's two different styles uh, available from them and you have to make sure you know what you're buying, whether you're getting the complete uh, grilled breast meat or just the diced up chicken breast. Let's get our potatoes in there and we'll let those get rehydrated. And pretty soon we'll have a winner winner chicken dinner here, hopefully. All right, our mashed potatoes have been sealed up and rehydrating in the pack here for a couple of minutes. Now it's time to dish some of this out. One thing about this new packaging or this new way this product is being made is everything is just mixed together. The flavor is really good. The chicken is moist and tender. Uh, the mashed potatoes are a little on the salty side, but I think that's to be expected in any freeze-dried meal pouch that, that you're going to eat. So overall, I would say this is a winner winner chicken dinner. I'm going to check when I uh, get back to headquarters if we are still able to buy the chicken dinner with the two grilled chicken breasts versus this one. If this is a uh, option that you have now for Mountain House or if it's only coming this way, that'll be something that I'll certainly want to find out and answer. Okay, as I said, when I got back home, uh, I would inquire uh, about this and I did do just that. Uh, I reached out to Mountain House via email and they replied within a few days and told me that this meal has been changed now to the model that you see uh, reviewed today. Uh, the old grilled chicken breast and mashed potato dinners is no longer being offered and now it is simply 
uh, the diced chicken and mashed potato meal that, that we uh, showed. Uh, there's certainly nothing wrong with this meal. The flavor is very similar to what we used to buy. Um, probably, and I, and I can't verify this because I don't have one of the older meals to do any measurements, but uh, I, I would assume we're getting a little less chicken in the new one than what we used to get. The price on these things, which should have been a clue to me when I purchased them, like $7.50 or just under $8.00. Uh, and I think the other ones, are, at least in current times, uh, would have been more money than that. So. Nutritional facts, this is showing two servings uh, per envelope. I believe that was exactly what the other one said, the older one said. Um, a single serving is 220 calories. The complete container is 450 calories. Total fat uh, per serving is 9%, 7 grams. For the whole envelope, it's 13 grams or 17%. Saturated fat is, uh, for the whole envelope, is 5 grams. Cholesterol is 135 milligrams. Again, I'm just going to continue on with the whole envelope uh, for the rest of this list. Sodium is 1,480 milligrams, which, you know, we, we talk about that all the time. These freeze-dried meals are typically going to be high in sodium. Um, total carbs for the complete package is 40 grams. Uh, dietary fiber is 3 grams, total sugars is 7 grams, protein is showing 21 grams, but looking at the nutrition facts on the back of this meal, that's showing us that amount for one serving. So if you take in uh, account for the, this entire container, or two servings as they're calling it, the protein is shown at 43 grams. So um, that's a pretty substantial amount of protein in this little meal envelope here. So. Overall, I think this is still a very great deal. Uh, they changed it from the chicken, the two grilled chicken patties that we were used to seeing to a diced chicken and mashed potato meal. Probably is a little bit more convenient to eat this way, quite frankly. You don't have to worry about cutting up a chicken breast and all that. So overall, I would say the Mountain House chicken and mashed potato dinner is still uh, one of their uh, very best offerings and certainly worthwhile to look at and purchase. We've talked before about the model of the readiness channel being plan, prepare, and practice. And this is one of the reasons that I talk about that as much as I do, because it's important to test these products to see if they work for you and your family nutritionally, taste-wise, if, if your kids like them, and so forth. Now's the time to be figuring these things out, not when you're living in a crisis or some type of a situation where your very life depends on the types of foods that you've bought. If you like the information that we've provided for you in today's video, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button down below. And as always, get ready so that you and your family can succeed and thrive. Well, enjoy this uh, video and let me ramble because I really have no idea what I'm talking about now.